Disclaimer, this video is for educational purposes only. Hey amazing hackers, Hack Shooter here from HM Cyber Academy. In this session, let us solve this particular lab called File Path Traversal, Traversal Sequence Stripped with Superfluous URL Decode. Okay. This lab contains a file path traversal vulnerability in the display of product images. We already know that. The application blocks input containing path traversal sequence. Okay. Uh, it then performs a URL decode of that input before using it. Right? That's great. To solve the labs, retrieve the content of this particular one. Okay. It says that it performs an URL decode before directly, you know, uh, sending into the repeat uh, uh, processing that particular input okay so what if we do encode twice okay okay anyway i think i have revealed the answer right here but yeah let me go to this particular one go to the lab oh there's something mistake here let me open the lab again okay we have the lab here and without any delay just intercept and take this particular request Oh, this is not the one, sorry. Forward. Okay, forward. 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 Okay, this is the one. Take it to the repeater. Turn off the intercept, always. And go to the repeater, hit on send. Okay, so now let us directly put that uh, dot dot slash dot dot slash dot dot slash etc slash passwd. Okay, okay, let us do one thing. Let us try all the traditional ways. Okay, control C, delete. Okay, so let me hit on send. No, it's not working. So now let us put this, uh, delete. Okay, let us hit on send. No, it is not, this is also not working. Again, dot dot slash in between. And once more, dot dot slash in between. And again, dot dot slash in between. And hit on send. No, this is also not working. Fine. So the only way, I mean, uh, let us go as per the question. So it says that uh, let us let me remove all these dot dot slash and replace with the regular one. Okay. So the point is like it is encode, it is decoding the uh, you uh, uh, decoding the particular parameter or the value what we are giving here. Okay, well, once we are sending it like this, it is giving like this. Okay, let us do one thing. Let us encode this slash. Okay, go to the converter and uh, URL and URL encode all characters. So we are encoding this particular URL, uh, this particular slash itself. Just copy the slash and paste it over here and here as well. Uh, forget about this, uh, this one. It's fine. It's completely fine. Okay, so let me hit on send and again it is giving the same way that means it is directly decoding this once URL decode and uh, that's how we are getting this. Okay, so let us, let me do one more uh, once more URL uh, encode but this time I'll only encode this one. Okay, not the other one. Okay, only this one. Just right click and where is this sorry this one URL encode. Okay, so now this everywhere I need to encode this particular uh, character. Uh, sorry, like this. And here also, right click. And where is this? Encode. Right. And hit on send. And now you have got this. The reason is the application or the firewall is decoding this particular value only once. But here we have encoded it twice. That means it has to decode it twice, right? But it is not decoding it twice. That's the reason uh, we are able to bypass and the same is being processed by the file system and it is giving the output here directly. Okay, anyway, congratulations. I think the lab is solved. Yeah, congratulations. The, sol the lab is solved and have a great day. Bye-bye.